Assalamu alaikum students, how are you all? I hope you are fine and staying safe at home. So grade 3, get ready for your science class. Look at the picture of a boy. Is he looking healthy? No, not at all. Now, look at this boy. He is healthy and fit. Health is the most important thing because a healthy body keeps a healthy mind. So let's start our lesson which is Unit 2 Health and Safety. Before starting the lecture, let me introduce some keywords. And the keywords are first is rusty, vigorous, grumpy, concentrate, balanced diet, electrical appliances, pavement, first aid. Now I will tell you the meanings of the keywords. Rusty means something covered with rust. Vigorous means full of energy. Grumpy means bad tempered. Concentrate means to focus. Are you all concentrating? Alright. Next is balanced diet. Balanced diet is a diet that contains different kinds of foods in certain quantities. Electrical appliances are devices driven by electricity. Pavement is a footpath or path for pedestrians. First aid is the first immediate help. Now look at this picture. This is the picture of nails which are covered with rust. So these are rusty nails. Let's come towards the first part of the lesson that is health. Good food, plenty of exercise, fresh air, enough sleep, and clean habits all help the body to last a long life. Exercise Exercise makes the bones and muscles strong. It also leads to better health and it makes people feel good. Exercise such as running, swimming fast, or playing sports is more vigorous. It makes our heart, lungs, and muscles work harder. We should aim to do a range of different activities to work our body and keep fit. What is good food? We need to eat a balanced diet to stay healthy. A balanced diet is eating a wide variety of foods in the right amounts and having the right amount of food and drink to achieve and maintain a healthy body weight. Here is a guide to the amounts of bread, rice and grains, meat, fish, nuts and eggs, milk and dairy products, fruits and vegetables and fats and sugars we should eat. Fruits and vegetables should be the major portion of our diet. After this, we should take grains group which includes grain, cereals and potatoes. After that, food group containing dairy products is highly important, especially for your bones health. This food group contains milk, butter, cheese, etc. Next important food group consists of meat, fish, nuts and eggs. These are protein rich foods. Last food group contains fats and sugar. You have to take these foods in relatively lesser quantities because these are not as good as the first group. Water. Water is essential for life. You have to take 8 to 10 glasses a day to stay hydrated. Sleep and rest. Your body and your brain need to rest. When we sleep well, we feel refreshed. An 8 years old usually needs about 10 hours of sleep. If you do not get enough sleep, your body and your brain can be affected. You may feel grumpy, unable to concentrate and not have much energy. Now, let's come to the other part of our lecture that is safety. Even while staying at home, you have to be very careful, especially while using things that run on electricity. Never touch bare wires of electricity and don't go near electronics or electric appliances. You have to be very careful in the kitchen as well. Don't touch sharp objects. There are many sharp instruments in the home. They have a purpose. Use them carefully. 
never run with them or leave them lying around in the kitchen never go near the stove keep clear of food that is cooking boiling water can burn the skin hot oil can cause bad burns never play with razors glass or medicines medicines are prescribed by the doctor to cure diseases never play with them you can slip on slippery floors of bathroom so you have to be extra careful while using the bathroom at school you have to adopt good habits and avoid bad habits good habits are listen to your teachers properly follow their instructions follow the rules and maintain the discipline of your class do not make mess in class while you are on the street you have to follow traffic rules these rules are made for our safety not abiding by the rules can cause serious accidents never play on busy roads it can be very dangerous for you if you are a pedestrian you should use pavement to walk on use zebra crossing to cross the road while playing in the playground you have to be very careful do not play roughly in the playground you have to show your good manners wait for your turn while taking swings look for others and be caring let me tell you now about first aid first aid is the first treatment you give to an injured person if you can't help an injured person call an adult to help do not crowd around injured person always maintain a first aid box at your home it should have all the necessary things which can be required in case of emergency i am sharing a link of a video you can watch it and make your concept more clear about health and safety let's come to the concept check fill in the blanks first is when walking on a busy road walk along the dash walk along the just think over it yes when walking on a busy road walk along the pavement very good second is look carefully in dash directions before crossing the road so think for the answer yes look carefully in both directions before crossing the road second question is put the labels on this plate to show how much of each type of food a balanced diet includes bread rice and grains meat fish nuts and eggs milk and dairy products fruits and vegetables fats and sugars take your time and do it all right now i will show you my answers you have to check your answers with mine i have planned a little homework for you this includes two worksheets this is your worksheet number 1 of chapter 2 question number 1 is color the pictures and number each one so they are in the right order five pictures are given to you you have to sequence them and after sequencing them you have to write the number of sequence in the box given under each picture so after doing this you have to do question number 2 which is be creative and think of catchy names for healthy and nutritious snack foods for a restaurant include list at least 5 choices for each section two sections are given to you first is school snacks and second is before dinner snacks you have to write your choices in both the sections question number 3 is write true or false by each statement first is you should wear a bike helmet 
whenever you ride a bike true or false second is bike injuries can send children to the hospital true or false third is it's okay to wear sandals or flip flops when you ride a bike true or false fourth is you should always ride in the opposite direction to the traffic true or false fifth is hand signals do not help keep you safe when you ride a bike true or false now you have to choose your answers and tick the correct answer chapter 2 worksheet number 2 question number 4 cross out the wrong practice for a safe kitchen first clean counters and cooking surfaces second don't cook without an adult third don't eat cold leftovers fourth no foil or metal in microwave fifth point knife away from yourself sixth eat the food that falls on the floor seventh wash veggies after cooking eighth do not wash hands ninth do not use pot holder for hot pots and pans tenth baggy clothes can catch fire Question number 5 is Any is playing in her room circle the things which are hazardous Any is playing with her doll she has a lot of things over here so you have to circle the things which are dangerous and i hope that you can do it very well the concept check on page number 16 i am including as your home task in which you have to put a tick next to all the things that will help your body to keep working well put a cross next to the things that could harm your body first is regular exercise second eating lots of sugary snacks third running in the kitchen when someone is cooking fourth playing outside in the fresh air fifth climbing on furniture in your house sixth using faulty electrical goods this is the end of the lecture i hope you have understood it very well stay home stay safe and stay blessed thank you